So we got a very weird end to the first period in tonight's Tampa Bay Toronto game, culminating in the linesman basically pushing a player off the ice, which is something I can't say I've ever really seen, at least recently. All right, so for a bit of backstory, tensions were rising a bit towards the end of the first period of the Leafs Lightning game. The Leafs were on a power play after Nylander got tripped by the Lightning. The Leafs went for the somewhat risky five forwards approach, and maybe unsurprisingly that ended up with them losing the puck and chasing it in their own zone. First of all, Nylander blew a tire. It may have looked like a trip to some on the ice. Then, although they never really showed it, Marner got hit at the end of the play pretty hard. The period ends, pushing and shoving starts. Bunting heads towards Sergachev, who had given him a slash earlier that period. And he gets not only directed away from the play, but the ref literally pushes him out of the playing surface. This does seem to be excessive. I mean, you frequently see linesmen or referees getting handsy with players, whether it's breaking up scrums, stopping fights, whatever. Whatever. But in this situation, it just seems a bit much, especially where Bunting isn't actively really resisting, and you can see his reaction. What the fuck are you doing? It's just, it's not necessary, and the TSN panelists, including mostly past players, agreed. That being said, I think there are some people that are taking this way too far. Some even claiming that this was a very dangerous situation. I wouldn't really go that far. Yeah, he could have tripped, but I mean, I think the bigger issue is the fact that there's nothing Bunting can really do here, and it's an unfair and uneven use of power because if Bunting did half of this back to the referee, he'd be looking at a pretty long suspension. There's zero tolerance for that. So why is there tolerance for a referee unnecessarily handling a player? That I think is the key issue. TSN actually did a really poor job of broadcasting this. They didn't show the hit. That gives a hint that Bunting is actually heading back towards the ice at the end of the period. I would have loved to see what he did there. Overall, just an interesting situation. Now, the linesman here is Dan Kelly, who was a former AHL player. I saw posts about this hit from the the Calder Cup playoffs about six years ago. I'm not going to pretend that I remembered that or that I knew about that and was fuming about it the whole time. I don't know. I understand people being angry and I do think he deserves a talking to, but let's also try to be kind of reasonable, I think. Just my thoughts though. I think something like a one or two game suspension could be fine. I don't know if linesmen can be fined, but maybe I'm going too far or not far enough. I'm sure you'll let me know your thoughts down below.